We are kicking off Climate Week with some of the junior ROTC students and bringing them together because as we think about what does the future look like, it looks like students that are here to meet with me to talk about an issue that's important to both of us, climate change and its impacts. This is an issue that they really care about. This generation is paying attention. They are seeing the impacts. At the Navy, at the Marine Corps, we are seeing absolutely the same thing. And I want them to know that we think it's important. And if it's something that they want to contribute to, we've got a place for them, whether in or out of uniform, so that they understand this is what the future force looks like and this is what we're thinking about now. Some of the technology and demonstrations that the students will see here today will demonstrate how out in the field where nothing else is available, Marines are able to create energy so that it can keep focused on the mission and on the task at hand and not have to worry about their logistics as much. Climate change is a national security issue. Climate change is a threat uh, to what we do and how we do it. The Navy and Marine Corps, it is your naval fighting force. And so by default, they are at the coastlines and on the ocean. That is our operational environment. And so when you see these increased storms, we see sea level rise. Those are all of the things that are impacting the way that we operate because those are the essentials that make sure that we have what we need to do when we need to do it when the nation calls. And that's the opportunity that these students have as they plan what I'm sure will be their incredible futures. There's a pathway here that through science, through their passion for what is a big threat in our environment, whether you look at it from national security or from day-to-day -day living, they can make a difference and they certainly have a place to contribute with us.